All right, so the uh, death, death to Tiff Ward uh, thing. Let me get, let me get, let me get the quote. I'm gonna get the quote. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna show the image, but I'm gonna read parts of it. Okay, declaration of war against the Imperial Federation. I, Zoro, the homosexual, on behalf of Bro Nation, this day on the 13th of November, declare war on the Imperial Federation. And I'm gonna leave it at. I'm going to leave it right there, right? I'll get back to it, but just give me one second to break that down. So Zoro declares war on Tiff, right? Tiff is in charge by somebody who lives in Germany. Sorry to dox you a little bit, Rinjani. It was very necessary for this next point. It is currently Friday the 13th, or it, it was Friday the 13th, as it is for me right now, when Sol sent this declaration of war. Friday the 13th, that is bad shit. You never declare war on Friday the 13th. And his opponent was on Saturday the 14th because they live in a different time zone. Soul is fucked, bro. He is fucked. Bad news bears. Alright? That is point one, and I have read one sentence out of the Declaration of War. Point, okay, now we're going to get back on with uh, reading the rest of this. Uh, okay, second, second sentence. For too long has this menace been at large in the Mindsy world. Bros have been waiting... Bros have been waiting too long in the shadows, and the time has come to cleanse the world. Spoken to me in a dream from the god of water, in parentheses Pluvia, I saw a vision of Polster in flames in Judas Sicarius' head on a stake. It doesn't say Sicarius, it says something else, but I'm not reading that. Um, I like, legitimately had flashbacks of this part back to the Insurrection Drill Server after Joe nuked our alts where we had Joe's head on like a fence post over a fire in the graveyard of all of the alts that got killed like literally 150. Um, continuing. Da, 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 da. Me and my fellow bros were behind this cleansing. Pluvia, in full caps, instructed me to cleanse the land of the infidels and Germans. So I hope they... Did, do they have Z-Bot? I gotta know if they have Z-Bot. Because if they got Z-Bot and they're, they're, they're gonna kill... Germans, he was in a little bit of trouble. Uh, I will not take an elder god's pleas for folly. I don't even know what that sentence means. The time for war has come. Rise up, bro nation, and take to arms. We march on Polister and fight for Pluvia. They're, that's all full caps, but I'm not going to like scream it. There's a 99% chance that our enemy will be too afraid to log in or cry to Aggie Paggy for help. So that is why we must crush our enemies. The black community is with us in full caps. We will show the Imperial Federation no mercy. That is also in full caps. Bro Nation War Agreement Signatures. Zorok the Great, Tree A, Tree Top, Archer. Okay. Okay. Now down to brass tacks. We're going to break down the war, alright? So we... Bros and whoever else is with them declared war on Tiff. Now, Tiff is allied with imps, who are now going to be drug into the war, because they are allied. Now, another thing is all of the insurrection players who don't play anymore, Soul has already DM'd, because they have already told me that Soul has already DM'd them, so now they're going to play with pros, maybe, probably not, I really wouldn't count on that, maybe, like, one of them, but, like, Soul and... Milk were already X10 members. I don't know. Maybe Tekka plays with them too for like three seconds or Lunar or who else do I know that still is around? Maybe Jay. Uh, maybe deleted his Discord. Or got ousted out of the community for being crazy. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't really, really know who else to get with them. Um, so, yeah, yeah, I don't know. They have some bodies. Imps is apparently dead. Um, but, like, they've had decent relationships with the UTC. So, maybe the UTC gets involved or not, or does, like, some shadow bullshit. You, you never know. You got the UTC. So, now I want to bring us to our uh, roleplay map, alright? So, here we have our roleplay map, that PNG. You're going to see some maps here. Blue is bros. Red is Tiff. Now, pure imps claim like the west but apparently i'll quit so maybe that bro's territory really becomes just like a giant blob of purple here in a second um but anyways the only place where they're really gonna 
be fighting, in my opinion, is like Frostbane right now, or maybe they both avoid it. I, I can definitely see some fights happening in Frostbane. But um, if Bros really want to fight Tiff and they want to gank them, they're going to come up with the flank maneuver that I used, which was when you cut down through the Devil's Castle area and you take the Devil's Castle area with McLevinville, and then you just attack Polister from your fob forward operating base next to Devil's Castle. It works really well. You keep all it somewhere in that area. Well, you probably don't want to do that now because I just said that. Uh, I don't know how many people really have hundreds of all still. That's not really a thing anymore from my understanding. I know Tiff does, but like nobody else probably does. Um, Connor got blacklisted and so did I F. Um, so yeah, they, they probably can't do that realistically. Now, Tiff could actually counter flank them. All right. Now, you, if you see here, right, they counter flank all the way around. Soul and his goons, and they take over Water Spire and they farm it for depth. So that way, when they go into Crow, Soul can't kite into the deep water. It's a flawless, it's a flawless move, in my opinion. I don't see a way where that doesn't work. Depths are OP. At least they were. I don't know if they are anymore. I haven't played the game in nine months, but anyways. So. I think I have, I have another. Ah, yes. In the event that, uh, Bros somehow wins, which I don't think they will in any realistic sense. They're gonna have to force Tiff all the way to their colony, which I forgot to like color in because the fuck goes to a fire. Um, they could just run over to a fire and live in a fire for the rest of their lives. I heard like Rose Luck was broken at one point for gearing, so, like they could go to Rose Luck, get gear, and then live in a fire, and everything will be fine. Now, on a very serious note. Rose is a loose conglomerate of players, and Tiff is similar, but not entirely. They're like ex-Dawn Brigade. Dawn Brigade loses wars, but they don't really die as a clan. Um, Dawn Brigade, like, if somebody declared war on them, Dawn Brigade would get hopped a bunch of times. Or not, depending on how uh, keen... The Dawn Brigade leaders were at finding spies, or and how good the other group was at getting spies. And Dawn Brigade basically just gets hopped a bunch of times, and then at the end of the day, it's fine. Um, it literally took like four or five separate times where I fought Dawn Brigade and broke them down enough to the point where they disband, and really they disband because the leaders went inactive. Um, how much did I contribute to that? Probably not a lot, because most of them just got busy with life. Um, but they are a good punching bag. So, I don't know how Wolverine well Johnny's really going to handle that. So, I guess from that aspect, Rose maybe has a chance. But, if Tiff start to lose the war, what I foresee happening is Joe coming back and just stomping the shit out of Rose. Um, because I don't think Joe's going to sit there and just let Tiff die. If Ren Johnny is like, I don't know what I'm doing, we're, we're losing, how do I make us not lose? Joe's gonna come back from the shadows if he has any chance to do so, he will. So, uh, basically, the uh, synopsis is if I could beat up a little bit, but they're probably gonna win um, because I doubt this coalition stays together long enough to actually do something about it. Now, as an absolute beam, I have it joined this. Uh, I guess I can say the name of the Discord. Death to Tiff War Discord. The image of the Discord is literally my skin. Um, so, we out here. Yeah, I, I, I don't see this going particularly well for the uh, side I'm on. But, I think it'll be fun for all parties involved. And it's retarded and people start uh, taking things... Outside of just fighting each other in games, like literally, like, even if we get to the point where there's like excessive spying on both sides, I'm just gonna dip and just watch this from the YouTube comments. So, without further ado, good luck to everyone.